Hey everybody, today we're going to be going through how to get drones in the game Slime Rancher. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is purchase the lab, which can be accessed right behind your house on your main ranch. So if you go ahead and access this, you'll be able to purchase the lab for 10,000 new bucks. After you've purchased the lab, we'll head over to the warehouse next. So now that we're inside the warehouse, we'll head over to the left and access the builder shop first. So there are a few things we're going to need from this builder shop, one of them being the novice drill as well as the novice apiary. You may also notice that there is the drone down below, which we will need to purchase once we acquire all those resources needed to actually fabricate one. So to start with the novice drill as well as the novice apiary, you may notice that there is an advanced drill as well as advanced apiary. Now these will not become available to you right away for the advanced drill you'll need to wait five days after purchasing the lab and then this blueprint will become available to you. And for the advanced apiary, this will become available five days after purchasing the novice apiary. So once you acquire the blueprints for the advanced drill as well as advanced apiary, I would highly recommend start just crafting as many of these as you can rather than the novice because as you may notice, you will be able to acquire a lot of those rare resources and they do last three extra cycles. And then once we actually start acquiring some of those resources needed for the drone, we can go ahead and purchase the drone next. After you've purchased the novice or advanced drill, as well as the novice or advanced apiary, we can actually start fabricating some of these drills and apiaries to start acquiring some of the resources we're going to need to start fabricating some of those drones. And now if we head over to the utilities tab, as you can see here for the drone, it tells you exactly what's required to start fabricating some of these drones. And at the bottom there, there is wild honey, jelly stone, as well as hexacomb. So those extractors are going to be used to start acquiring these resources needed to fabricate this drone. So in order to actually fabricate these extractors as well as drones, we're going to have to deposit the plorts as well as resources into the refinery right here. After you finish fabricating both the drill as well as apiary, we'll head outside the warehouse and go into builder mode. So we'll go ahead and access one of these spots here. And what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and install an advanced drill in this location here. So now that we're waiting for this extractor to finish, what we're going to do next is head over to the moss blanket and place one of the apiaries down next. So now we're in the moss blanket located here on the map. So what we're going to do is go into builder mode once again. And we're going to go ahead and place the apiary that we fabricated in this location right here. So at this point, all we need to do is go ahead and wait until the time runs out. Or what we can do is head back to the ranch and sleep until morning, whichever way works better for you. Once the apiary is ready, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and activate it and obtain some of the resources that it acquired. As you can see here, both the hexacomb as well as wild honey is obtainable in this location. And now if we head back to the drill that we placed right outside the warehouse, if we go ahead and activate this, as you can see here, we'll be able to acquire some of that jelly stone, no problem. So now that we have the resources needed to go ahead and fabricate one of these drones, we'll go ahead and do this next. After fabricating one of the drones, we'll head back into builder mode and we'll go ahead and place the drone in one of these spots here. So now that we've placed a drone down, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and program it for what we want it to actually do. So if we head over into the target, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and choose plorts for this specific drone and then we'll head over to source and then we'll go ahead and select plort collectors for this drone just for the sake of the video and then the destination we'll go ahead and select the destination as silos if we go ahead and activate this now as you can see here the drone is now heading over to those plort collectors to start gathering some of those plorts for us and deposit them in the silo located beside the corral. So I hope this video is helpful for you guys. If it was, please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below to see more content just like this one.